Hey guys, Mechanic CG here, and welcome back to another episode of Colin McRae Dirt. Today is episode number four. If you want to keep up to date with all going on in this series, then make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. And make sure to check out the description for our social links. We've got Twitter, Instagram, and Discord. But hopefully you guys do enjoy today's video. Saving content. Right, this is the four-wheel drive rally in Falston, United Kingdom. So we have a choice of four cars now. We got the Punto, the 207, or we can take the Impreza or the Evo. Now, I feel like taking the Impreza maybe, but taking the Impreza with the no fear design. Here we go. All right, let's go. No fear in Pretzer at Falston United Kingdom. Let's do this. Right, let's do this. Let's Subaru. Show everyone how it's done. This is going to be my final recording session of today. 80, like, final race of today's jump. recording session. 60, left five, Titans, four over so, crest. I'm. Right three, I don't know whether this is going to be in the same video as tomorrow or whether 60, this is going to be the last race of the crest. episode. I'm not sure. I do that afterwards now. Working all that stuff out. But this car, this car, we've driven quite far in so far. Ah, four miles. Okay, maybe not. I thought that was 46 miles. I was like, that's quite far. Here we go. Also. Whoa! Okay. That was a save there. 40, left six, 40, right five into left five. Come on. Oh. 2.79 seconds ahead. 40, left six, 40, right five. 40, right two over crest. 40, left five, 60. Left Perfect. Three. Yeah, I really think I could and turn it up to Pro Am, but I don't want to risk it. I want to enjoy the game and not stress right out three. trying to win. 40, left five, over crest. 100, left five, over crest. As much as I want to win, stressing out isn't the way to do it. 80, right five. 80, right five, and crest. 60, right four, and left Oh, there we go. 5.58 seconds ahead. And right six over jump into left four opens long. 150, left six. Ah, we spun. That happens quite a few times. It's almost inevitable Eight, sometimes. Left six long. Titans five into Here we right go. Perfect. Three. Whoa. 60, left 6, over crest. Went a bit too quick through there. And two crests into right 3 and left 4 opens. Crest, crest. 150. Crest, right 5 and sign, right 4 long. And left 4, 60, right whoa, 3 onto whoa. tarmac. Nice. 150, crest and left six. 80, left six, left five into right four. 80, right four and left four. Oh, no, 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 no. We've gone off, we've gone off. Get back up. Perfect. 150, right five. 100. Finish. Awesome. And there's the finish line. That was a very good race. How far? Great stuff. How far ahead were we? We couldn't have been too far. How far were we? 318.88 was our time. Oh, so we were less than two seconds. Fair enough. That wasn't our best performance, but that was an okay performance. That was an okay performance for now. Hey, even I was impressed. Awesome all the way. And there we go, 75,000 pounds. 
75,000 British dollar dues. So uh, next up, we're going to be moving on to tier three. So we got hill climb, big rig, rally raid T4, four wheel drive crossover, and rally classic to look forward to. Right, so we are now moving on to tier number three. And uh, I went back, did this rally cross. We've gotten 10 points for that. So, so far, 10 points on everything. And what we're starting off with is the Pikes Peak Hill Climb today. And we're going to be taking big rigs. Yes, we're taking big trucks. Now, we have a choice of this one, the Kenworth T2000. Or we have the big Wang Mobile. Obviously, we've got two events. So, each one we're going to take this one and then the next one will take that one so we're gonna buy this 280,000 truck first of all uh, what designs do we have oh you know what I fancy the red one but that's 14,000 so uh we'll stick with the yellow design for now and we are moving over to Pikes Peak let's do this all right here we go big rig time Look at the size of this thing. Oh, a little bit wide there. Let's see if we can make it through this track in one piece. The big shame is that this uh, vehicle is only available for two events. And there are no other events after this. It's just, that's it. No other big rigs. The big rig dies out completely. Off we go. That is very nice. Oh. Keep it steady. It is a big rig though. Going around Pikes Peak. That is pretty crazy. And I think, if I remember correctly, this is the Pikes Peak when they had done... Half of the resurfacing. So obviously Pikes Peak was just a dirt track before. Um, and they did just off-road racing back in like the 80s, I think. But then whoa, towards the uh, 2000s, they uh, started to resurface uh, Pikes Peak and surface it with tarmac. Uh, Pikes Peak now is all tarmac. There is no dirt whatsoever. Which is a massive shame because Pikes Peak could have been a really good dirt track. There was so much potential for it and they just tarmacked it. And now that it is tarmacked, there's no going back. You can't really untarmac it. Because it just won't be a proper dirt track then. I mean, they could, but are they going to? Big rig is going though at some speed. Here we go, we're on to dirt now. It's actually surprising we're uh, driving on dirt in this thing though. Oh, hairpins. Our worst nightmare. There we go. I think as well they have mapped the entire of the Pikes Peak Mountain, uh, which is pretty cool. Come on, very nice. Come on! Awesome. That is amazing. Here we go. Here's the finish line coming up. And across it. There we go. 3 minutes 20.89. Yeah, you've won the championship, dude. Nice driving. Nice driving. That was nicely done. Very good. 320.89 total time, about 15 seconds faster than uh, the rest of the Americans. They're all Americans in this race.
Very nice. Awesome, man. Who taught you to drive like that? Out of sight. And 125,000 Great British Pounds. Obviously, there are less events as you go up the tiers, but the events do get longer. Uh, next up is another very interesting Rally Raid T4. And we have these big rigs, these big guys to drive now. Uh, in fact, I want to change the design for this one. I want to go for this one. Um, so we're going to take this truck and then we're obviously going to move over to the other one. But look at that thing. I'm looking forward to driving that. But let's go. Uh, we are going to Lower Ate Lake, which I'm, if I am correct, is the first rally raid event that we did. So let's do this. All right, here we go. No room for failure. Had a couple of network issues on my uh, PS3. Yeah, but we always have a network issues when it comes to recording. It's mandatory. It's mandatory that a you got disconnected from the internet pops up at some and point. Right four and left four and right four. Awesome. These things are massive. Four, very long and right two. And this isn't the uh, first track either. It was the uh, second rally raid track that we used. Go, go, go. Come on. Nice. Left six and right four long. Keep it steady. And Keep left it smooth four and, and steady. Left five into right three. Sixty. Right five. Nice. Here we go. Right three, left Come four, on. Right oh, neck and neck. Oh. Keep it steady. Very nice. 200. These things are prone to rolling over as well. They are very easy Caution. to roll over. Crest, left so three. this tight corner here, I want to slow down big time for. 100. Whoa, the amount of body roll then. Right four, tightens three and left three. <laughs> that was two wheels. That was two wheels. And right five into left five. Holy crap. This is getting a, a little bit sketchy. 150, jump and crest left five. Oh, the amount that this thing is bouncing around. That's enough to break your right back. Three. Like, your spine would not like this one little bit. 60, left five and right oh. three. No, you're not getting past. And left four, tightens. 150, right three. Very nice. Oh, he's right behind me. And left four and right five. I don't want to overdo it. We're keeping it steady and stable. 80, narrows and jump and time point. And across the line. Three minutes and one second for that. I'm so stoked, we won. That was crazy. The amount of power that these things have, there's like a thousand horsepower in these, but because they're like 10 tons, you've got not much power to actually work with in terms of power to weight ratio. That's why the other truck is a lot more powerful, because you've got an extra 10 horsepower. Too cool for school. You've got two new events lined up. There you go. Two new events unlocked. That's awesome. Ta-da! Right, uh, next up is... Oh, saving content. There we go. 
Right, next up is the crossover four-wheel drive in Germany. Uh, so we have a choice. Your work here is done, my friend. Time to move it on up to pro -Ams. Nope. So we can take either the Mitsubishi or the Subaru, but there's actually another car that's just unlocked, which is the Peugeot 307. And this one has an extra 40 horsepower than the Subaru and 30 to the Mitsubishi. So I feel like this would be a much better car to take for today. Uh, so yes, I would like to purchase. Thank you very much. And then do we have... Oh, that design looks very nice. Oh, I'm going to take the black design for now. Uh, so we are at Avil's back ring, I think. I think that's how you say it. I probably butchered it. Germany with the 307. Right, here we go. Perfecto. Got off to a very good start. This Peugeot is powerful. Much quicker than I was expected. I think this race is entirely tarmac. But I'm not 100% sure. There may be dirt sections. It's so grippy, right, that I can't even control it through the corners. Like, it is overshooting the corners. Awesome. Right, we've got the long sweeping corner now underneath two bridges. Very good, very nice. Oh, hit the wall there. But managed to keep control of it across the line. 1 minute 10.93. I'm excited. Sponsors are ecstatic. You must be feeling pretty good. That is awesome. That was a very good run. 1 minute 10.93. Let's see if we can beat that. The uh, fastest of the other race was 122. Uh, 120. And the slowest of our race was 170. That is interesting. But that is how brutal this sort of layout is. You can still be faster than the other two cars, but you can still get knocked out. And here we are back at the service area for the next race. Let's do this. 27 podiums. Very nice. We've got a load of statistics here now. Vehicles, uh, 16 out of 46. So we've got another 30 vehicles to buy. Okay. I'm not complaining. 26 wins. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. And we've been driving for an hour and 11 minutes so far. I think we're about, um... 24% done. Drive like the wind, my friend. Enjoy Here we go. Let's do this. He's not even getting anywhere near the red line when he shifted. Awesome. We are going. Let's see if we can get a much better time. We were a 110 last time. Come on. This is looking very good. We got one ten point three. What's that faster? We obviously got a one ten last time. Are we faster this time? It is a personal best. One ten point three. What was our last time? 
110.93. So we were 0.63 seconds faster. That is very good. That is very, very good. Colin McRae, dirt. Too cool for school. You've got two new events lined up. Right, we've got ourselves 125,000 Great British Pounds. Right, we unlocked uh, Class 1 Buggies. Awesome. Uh, saving content. Next up is going to be Classic Rally. And we have a choice of either the Celica, which we took last time, or we can take the Super Impreza. So I feel like uh, changing it up a little bit and taking the Impreza. Um, but we don't have a lot of money, so I might take our Celica again, obviously with a Casterol, because we have got more events we can get the Subaru later. Um, and we are going to Brindabella in Australia. Right, here we go. Smooth and steady. I'm Mr. Smooth and you're Mr. And we go in. Let's go. And right four. Oh, keep it steady. 40, right four and left five. And right five long. Into left four, tightens into right four. Right, Dim very nice. Pressed. Into left four, into right three, left three. 150. 150. Left six, long into right five and left five over crest. 60, left five. 40, right four, long into left five. 60, left six, 40, right three. 40, left five, 40, right five. Also, awesome. oh, 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 okay. And, right six, and we are 6.19 seconds ahead. Into left five long, Titans three. It's very decent. And right six, 100. Right five long over crests. We've got to make sure we keep it as long. calm as possible and not uh, jumble our car 60, up too right much. Long, 40, left four over crest. And narrow, right five, 80, left three. 60, right two. Nice. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Terminal damage. That is the first time that has happened. The trees are the only thing stopping you from really going fast. Uh oh. Stage. And left four, I don't think I'm going right to cut that four. one out because it wasn't too far in. 40, right four, and left five. And right five, long. That is into the first time we've four, had a terminal tight, damage. Right four, dip over crest. Into left four, into right so we're going to have to look out three, on the insides of all of these corners now for trees. Left six, long into right five, and left five over crest. That tree took 60, out wheel out. Five. It's gone. 40, right four, long into left five. 60, left six, 40, right three. 40, left five, awesome. 40, right five. 80, left three. Careful. Don't want to ruin it again like we did last 40, time. Crest and right six, Titans four. 4.82 seconds ahead. Into left five, long. A little bit three. less, but not too much of a problem still. And right six, 100. Right five, long over crests. And left five. Very long. good. 60, right five, long. 40, left four, over crest. And narrow, right five, 80, left three. Nice. 60, right two. 60, left five. 150. This is going very well. Left five and right five, long into left six. 10.14 seconds ahead. 40, dip, left five. Uh, the tree was somewhere 80, over this corner, six. maybe? 60, left six, 40, right three, 80, left four. I'm into not sure right anymore. Five opens. I think we've gone past the tree. And left six, long. 60, left five, long. 
to right four and right five over crest. And left four and right five. 60, left four into right four. And awesome. right five long. Whoa. Keep it steady. 14.09 seconds ahead. And crest and right five long. Titans four. Nice. Left four into right four. You can tell I'm totally concentrating right now. Crest, keep left. Like I have total concentration. Crest, left five. Keep it 60, steady. Right four, long. 60, left five, Sometimes I long, don't have right the guts five. to just push. And left five over dip and right five. 60, jump, 60, finish. Where's the finish? I can't see it. There it is. 17.7 .7 seconds faster than Mr. Colin McRae. We did it. We won the the legend. Great stuff. Great stuff. That was very good. 313.18. That was very good. The crash did uh, take me off by surprise. Check this out. I wasn't Number expecting four. to wipe Check out. It. Love it. Hundred thousand Great British pounds. And we got the final event there, but also tier four is now unlocked. Which is going to be really cool to try out. But we got to save content first. Right, next up is the class one buggy in Bark River. Very uh, interested name. Uh, amateur. So we have a choice of either the McMillan racing car or the Ickler Jimco buggy. Which one's better? The Jimco easily. We'll go for this one for two events and then we'll buy the other one. We wouldn't have been able to um, afford these if we bought the Subaru. We wouldn't have been able to uh, do this event. Um, I actually quite like that Piper Cross livery. Right, let's go to Buck River then. Right, here we go. Oh. Okay, there was a lot of contact through that corner there. These buggies are a lot more difficult than you would imagine to be able to drive. They are very difficult. Awesome. Look at that. Okay, not great. We've lost the position there. We're also losing a lot of speed because of this uh, barrier that's stuck to the front of our car. There we go. We lost three positions because that barrier got stuck. No, two positions. I can't count. Don't want to crash into those. Come on then. Let's get around this corner. Let's see if we can get second for this race at least. Their time. That was 
big ass. Trying to catch up with uh, first place is going to be really tricky now. Not impossible, but tricky. Nah, couldn't quite get him. 1.3 seconds behind. You're on the podium, man. Big smile now. That was really good. That was fun, that last race. And that jump was insane, how high we went. That was also the first time I played that track in like 10 years, so I'll take second place for that one. I can always come back off camera anyways and redo it, which is what I will be doing. Good driving, man. First place isn't far off. Awesome. Eight points for that. And 60,000 Great British Pounds. Saving content. Awesome. Next up is crossover in Japan at the Numata Raceway. Right, let's do this. This is four-wheel drive, but we don't have the Peugeot as an option for this one. Um, I feel like we've... Which did we take last? Did we take the Mitsubishi or the Subaru? I think we took the Subaru last. So I think we'll take... We'll take Subaru. We'll go for it. Go for the Subaru. You can never go wrong with a good Subi. We've lost two races. Great. Alright, here we go. Let's do this. I remember this track. This is a track I remember fondly. I did this race a lot. This was my favourite. I really hope I don't lose this race because that will be embarrassing now that I've just said that. The cool thing is you feel like you're miles behind on the first lap, like the first go round, but this one is so much shorter. Perfect. And then you got this sticky out bit. Go, 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 go. And across the line. 1 minute 5.33. Great result. You floored it on that one. That is very, very quick. Wow. Okay. I'll take that. 1 minute 5.33 seconds. And everyone else in this championship is Japanese. Fair enough. And we were only driving Japanese cars as well. Kind of makes sense. Saving. There we go. Right. Let's go to Japan. Numata Raceway for the second race. We've got 31 podiums so far, which is very good. These loading screens obviously are quite long, but it it's like tells you everything. Like I don't even know Kabera Park, but that's been my favourite track for the past like God knows how long, and I swear we haven't been to there yet. Haven't rolled the car yet, which is very decent. Now that I've said that, I'm gonna roll it this race. Knock him dead, tiger. Let's go. Subaru. That is really good corner there. Impressive. Oh, we are doing really well on these corners. Look at that. I think the last time we were probably taking it a little bit too safe. But this time I definitely feel much safer pushing the corners. Oh, 
Awesome. And here we go across the line. 1 minute 5.12. How much faster was that? I know it was definitely faster, but how much faster is the question. Yeah, so it definitely is faster. 105.12. And our last one was 105.33. Oh, so it wasn't too much faster. I definitely felt the flow a lot more as I was going through those corners. I definitely felt it more. Awesome. First place? That's fantastic. Congratulations. At 125,000 quid. That's the most British word ever. The word quid. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you did enjoy, be sure to leave a like, comment down below, and subscribe. Make sure to check the description down below for all of our social links. We've got Instagram, Twitter, and Discord. And if you want to stay up to date with Colin McCrory Dirt, then make sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. If you want to help support the channel, make sure to hit the join button and also check out our merch link down in the description. But thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Goodbye.